Cytomegalovirus, CMV, is a common virus that is usually harmless, which is usually transmitted through sexual contact or contact with blood and other body fluids of an infected person or from transplanted organs. The virus can also spread from an infected mother to the growing fetus through the placenta. A pregnant woman can pass CMV to her fetus following infection by CMV for the first time. Reinfection with a different CMV strain or reactivation of a previous infection during pregnancy. Primary CMV infection in pregnant women will cause about 30% intrauterine infection and 60% to 80% of their infected neonates will develop sequela. In contrast, pregnant women with secondary CMV infection only have only a 0.2 to 2% risk of causing intrauterine infection. This is why it is important to identify primary CMV infection. CMV serologic tests are important for identifying primary infection since IgM positive result in combination with IgG avidity results are considered reliable evidence for primary infection. Congenital CMV infection is the most common intrauterine infection. Only one in five infants with congenital CMV infection will show significant signs and symptoms at birth. These include purple skin splotches or a rash or both, yellow skin and eyes, an abnormally small head, enlarged and poorly functioning liver or spleen. The diagnosis of congenital CMV infection can be made before birth or after birth. Prenatal testing includes ultrasonography of the fetus, amniocentesis to get amniotic fluid for viral culture or CMV-PCR, or fetal blood sampling for CMV-PCR or CMV-IgM measurement. After birth, the diagnosis can be made by a clinical examination and confirmed by PCR or viral isolation obtained under three weeks of age from urine or saliva samples in newborns.